Hey guys, it's Kristen7601 here, and whoa, I have new glasses! Yeah, expect more drawings of me with these new looking weird glasses that aren't circle. Anyway, I have an interesting story to tell you all. That just happened recently, actually. So I was at my cousin's baseball game, I won't mention whose, uh, but this, this game was a little little interesting because uh, I went with Eli and we were going to set up the scoreboard for it. You know, Eli from the Experiment Kids. And so we went over, went through this little gate thing and went up to this shed type thing. And the first thing that we noticed was that it was locked. Very awkwardly tightly locked. So what he did was take off one of those weird padlock square things and pretty much smashed it open. Uh, it was one of those slide locks that you, 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 it's one of those things where you slide it to open the door. It was stuck. So then we went inside and we're like, okay, that wasn't so bad. All we have to do now is lift up this thing to get it open so that we have light. And... Then we should be set to actually set up the scoreboard and plug it in, all that fun stuff. So what happened was, we took up this thing to get the light in. Mind you, this thing is very heavy, and there's only two of us. One of which is much shorter than the other. Sorry, Eli, you're, you're a, little, a little shorter than me. Um, anyway. We took this thing and we were holding it up and we couldn't figure out how to hook it to the top because there were hooks, but neither of us could reach them. So Eli's suggestion was to stand on a ta- the- not a table, a chair. And I was like, uh, no, that's unstable, let's just get somebody. So he went out, I was stuck holding this thing up alone with my weak noodle arms. He comes back and he's like, okay, I asked somebody, and she said she'll be here in a minute. And I said, okay, we'll just stand here and hold this up. So in the meantime, we're standing there for quite a few minutes, and then we're like, eh, maybe we could get another person. So we gently put it down and grabbed one of his friends, and we all went back in, and we were kind of chatting. Eli went to go tell the, this woman that he asked earlier that we still needed help because he couldn't reach it either, the friend. So then we're stuck still holding it and we're kind of joking around a little bit. And then we accidentally slammed the thing down because I couldn't hold it. I thought the friend had it. Eli didn't have it either. Yeah, and it was pretty loud. So then I went out. And I was like, okay, we need somebody else. This is really not okay. And before you knew it, the lady comes over. She's like, what are you doing? You're distracting the picture. All of you need to get out. And I'm like, okay, that's fair enough. That was really loud. No big deal. It's cool. I am cool. Whatever, whatever. But then, but then this woman had to be like, you either know how to do it or you don't. And I'm just like... What? We did know how to do it. We knew that we had to hook it up to the thing. We couldn't reach it. We asked you for help like three or four times and you didn't show up. Meanwhile, mind you, this whole entire time she's just standing there giving instructions to like the pitcher or whatever and like not even getting somebody else who could help. So, yeah. Then it was just... Uh, uh.